getting ready for the Church of Jesus Christ. It was almost time for the true Church of Jesus Christ to be on earth again. Jesus gave Joseph Smith a revelation for the people. Jesus wanted the people to be ready for his church. He told them things they must know before they started his church. He told them more about his gospel. Jesus said the Book of Mormon teaches his gospel. He said the Book of Mormon is true. Jesus wants people to believe the Book of Mormon. It helps them obey God. Jesus told about his life. God sent Jesus to help the people on earth. Satan tried to make him do bad things, but Jesus would not listen to Satan. Jesus was sorry for the bad things people do. He bled and suffered for all people. People will not suffer if they repent. Wicked people put Jesus on a cross and killed him. Jesus' friends buried him in a tomb. After three days, Jesus was resurrected. He came back to life. Jesus did these things to help people who repent. He died to help people who have faith and are baptized. They will not be punished. They can go to heaven. People who do not repent will be punished. Jesus told about baptism. People who want to be baptized must repent. They must love and obey Jesus Christ. They must be eight years old or older. Then they can be baptized and be members of the church. Jesus taught the right way to baptize. He said a priest in the Aaronic priesthood or a man who has the Melchizedek priesthood may baptize a person. The man who has the priesthood takes the person into the water. He says a special prayer. The man who has the priesthood puts the person down under the water. Then he brings the person out of the water. Jesus said people promise to obey him when they are baptized. They must say and do good things. Jesus told about blessing babies. Men who have the Melchizedek priesthood can bless babies. The men hold the baby in their arms. One man gives the baby a name and a blessing. Jesus told about the sacrament. He said the people should take the sacrament often. If we do something bad, we should not take the sacrament. We should repent. Then we may have the sacrament. We take the sacrament to remember Jesus. The bread helps us think of Jesus Christ's body. We remember that he died for us on the cross. The water helps us think of the blood of Jesus. We remember that he bled and suffered for us in the Garden of Gethsemane. We make covenants when we take the sacrament. A covenant is a promise. We promise that we will try to be like him. We promise that we will always remember him. We promise to obey his commandments. His Spirit will be with us if we keep our covenants.